Hello Divas, Diamond Styles, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my YouTube channel, Femininity with Mama Gail. Today, let's do a quick little recap. The spring is in the air, the summer is coming, we will be out dating, mating, meeting, and greeting these gentlemen. Let's just do a short little recap of the things that we are to do to make sure that we are on point while we are allowing gentlemen to pursue us. The first thing is, be feminine, be flirty, soft, and sweet. Remember who you are, flow in feminine energy, and serve up femininity. The next thing, as I just stated a few minutes ago, let him pursue you. Do not chase a man down trying to get his time and his attention, even if you are interested in him. There's nothing more unattractive than a woman who is running down a man because she finds him attractive. Allow him to pursue you. You pique his interest. Get his attention by using your femininity and your flirtiness. When you do get a mate, the next point, or a potential, keep your legs closed for as long as you can. And I know you're probably saying, Mama Miguel, I've been single long enough, blah, blah, blah. But the longer you keep them legs closed, if the man is interested in you, the longer he will pursue you. The longer you'll have time to get to know him. A man loses interest, especially during the summer when there's a lot of hot chicks, other feminine flirty cuties out there that, you know, wants his time and attention. You give him them goods real quick and real easy, he gonna be out the door before you know it. The next point, be grounded. Stay centered. Stay consistent in who you are. Stay focused on what it is that you do. You have a hobby, keep your hobby. You have girlfriends, hang out with your girlfriends. Continue to do what it is that you do. The next point, don't waste your time to in trying to impress him with all of the, you know, conversation on you and focused on you and it's all about you and telling him all the things that you have and all the things that you own and your positions and things of that nature. Don't dominate the conversation. Listen. Give him time to speak. When you run your mouth all the time, a man's going to count that as a date. A date with you running your mouth and he's going to see from the door that you know you dominate the conversation you didn't get to know anything about him but he got to know everything about you even your weaknesses even you know because you talk too much we run our mouths too much the next point don't be needy don't be needy in a relationship i need you to call me i mean in a, in a getting to know i need you to call me i need you to text me i need you to this i need you to that we will lose people and I know this from experience you know being controlled and manipulative in relationships and trying to hold on and being needy not for anybody to purchase anything or do anything for me but the needy point of I need you to call me you know I need you to keep consistent I need you to keep in touch with me blah 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 we can't go into that you know the spring is in the air the gentlemen are going to be out the females are going to be out. There's going to be plenty to look for, forward to. Mask and all. So you can be needy if you want to and end up losing what you have the potential to keep, you know, for some time to get to know, to invest in, to communicate, to spend time with and things of that nature. Don't be needy. It drives men away. The next, next thing is never say when he asks you what you're doing or oh, I'm not doing nothing or oh, I'm available. Make yourself busy. Get busy, do something. When he asks you, what are you doing? Are you available? Let me check my schedule. You know, I'll get back to you in an hour or two. If it's not until the weekend, let me get back to you on Wednesday. I'll let you know if I'm available. Because if you're always available and you're not doing nothing, he's going to feel like you're a low life with nothing to do with your life but sit around and wait for a man to come and ask you out, rescue you. The last point, don't let him get to know just one side of you. Stay mysterious. We talk about being mysterious. Show up in different ways. Allow him to meet you one way and to see you in different forms. Always stay feminine. Always stay soft and sweet. Always stay a lady. 
show up cute, smelling good, looking good, the whole nine yard. But be mysterious. Let him see another side of you. This is Femininity with Mama Gail. Spring is in the air, sweetie. Enjoy your spring, your summer. Enjoy life and do you, boo. But make sure that you keep them legs closed until you know it's the proper time. He'll stay around longer. Have a blessed and prosperous day, Divas, Diamond Styles, ladies and gentlemen.